Okay, so now I'm going to be trying this Krylon Fusion for plastic. This is satin black. Warmed up the can, not quite as warm as I'd like, but I'm going to go ahead and test it out and see what happens. Had this can for a while, we'll see. Uh, I'm just going to shoot it on the 77 GMC truck interior here, and if it turns out good, I'm going to spray the same thing onto the F-250 interior. I've also got these parts here. Probably test out these first. These would be easier to clean up than the whole interior pan. So, I'll be back and let you guys know the results. Here are all the parts that I ended up painting with the Krylon Fusion satin black spray paint. It went on pretty nice. I think I got a little thicker than what I should have. I put on, I don't know, maybe three coats, four coats on some parts. And everything turned out really nice except for this interior. There's areas where it's splotchy and flat on the seat which in this interior once I weather it and everything it'll actually look okay but that part you can see right there that part didn't come out right and I'm not sure what happened I think there might be some oils left on there possibly but everything else came out really nice I did the dashboard and the firewall bulkhead area and they all came out really nice and this was a no primer just clean the parts up soap and water and I sprayed it on there. Looks really nice. I failed to take the small little flash pieces off of there, but it's not a big deal. I should be able to get that all uh, touched up. Here's a rear axle. And this, these parts here are off the 37 Ford panel. I have a video series on that, of the building of that. If you're interested, go check it out. So that came out really nice. And we have the front axle here. And then that part will be covered up with the wheel, so you won't be able to see it. And I just have some other parts here, but overall, it came out really nice. Um, I sprayed it outside. It was about 60 degrees. I warmed the can up a little bit with some hot water. It wasn't quite as hot, so it didn't flow quite as good as I wanted it to. And, um, I mean, it dried fast. I don't know if it was quite 15 minutes, because I kind of went outside, you know, shot a coat on there, let it sit, you know, went through each of the trees, because I had them all on uh, individual... Uh, little things and um, you know just wait a couple minutes sprayed you know another two or three coats on everything and that was the result that we came up with so overall I think it's good I mean it saved me a whole lot of time over having to prime everything and then paint it again so I think it was a good investment and this stuff goes for I want to say about five or six dollars I think it is could be less could be more I can't remember I've had this can for months but like I said, you guys see the results here. It laid down pretty good. And I guess let me know what your guys' experiences are. If you have any other uh, paint that you guys think is good or better or worse, you know, feel free to share your experiences. And I want to thank you all for watching. You guys take it easy, and I will see you soon.